Hi, my name is Sean Cochran from Cochran Design, and today I'd like to talk to you about my first ever award. This was for the IDF Award, it was in 2010. This was for, we did a whole house, it was a large house in Clapham Old Town, SW4. Beautiful area, beautiful road, it's called Macaulay Road, it's one of the largest roads down there, some absolutely stunning houses. And we did a kitchen, and the kitchen was actually based on, well, we wanted to, we wanted to make it something special, and we wanted to make something original, but the, and the client didn't want to be to, it's to look too extravagant, but to look really stunning, timeless and beautiful. So what we did was we built this huge, huge, huge table-like um, island, which was about five and a half metres. And then we based some legs on it. And the actual leg shape, I based it on a Russian shop putter's leg, a female Russian shop putter's leg. So we got the shape just right. You'll see it in some of the images in a moment. This actual project was um, probably the most advertised I've ever had. It was in, I think, nine magazines. It's been in about 45 different television series. Obviously has some appeal to some people. And today I'm here on an award series to show you our London interior design office. And here we have it. This is one of my favorite London projects. Certainly the favorite commercial project on this. We worked at number one Savile Row. Across the top of one Savile Row is a very large penthouse looking building, which is in fact an office. You'll see from the, the photos and video how cool it is. We managed to twist everything around. We wanted like a very classic contemporary feel, but to have some twists and turns to it. So what we did in order to do that, we kind of reversed things. We used concrete walls, but with the concrete walls, we had concrete panelling. And so rather than going for the modern concrete look, we sort of like turned it on its head and went for the very traditional architecture, modern finishes. Today I'm here to talk to you about our Liverpool Award. Now this award was one of my favourites, actual projects of all time really. As well, we, we started off and it was quite a transient um, project as such. So we bought the first apartment, or my client, excuse me, bought the first apartment and then we started designing that. Meanwhile, he bought the second apartment, so we, we integrated that into the design. Then he bought the third apartment, which we, we then had to do a slight redesign and ended up with probably the nicest apartment that the north of England can see. So today we have our best European hotel award. Again, this is for S. Vive, first winning the best Spanish hotel and then winning the best European hotel. We actually won this from the... European Property Awards and also the Best Interior and Designer Awards for that year. When we originally got the phone call to come and see the guys in Ibiza, that was very exciting, uh, especially being that we're up against David Collins Studios and several other one studios I really do admire. And to win it after that was, yeah. So this was um, a fantastic job. We were pitched against some other great designers and we were really pleased to get the project. It was to actually renovate the whole hotel, but over, as I said in my last interview, several sections. Now, after getting Deco, we moved on to the rooms and then through the rooms, we moved on eventually to the experience bar, which really ended up being quite some experience. It took five years to finish the hotel, working every off season. And at the end of it all, we sold it to Lionel Messi and his family, which was really quite an honor. Today, I want to show you this award for one of my favourites. It's my own home. So we won Best Interior Design Private Residence London. Now this project, um, we started, I actually started many years ago because I built um, two penthouses on top of a block that we'd purchased the freehold of. Um, and later moved in there and then we moved out again <laughs> after working out our design. And then finally we won, as you can see, Best London area design. So a project well worth doing. 